Field Fabricated Pipe Seal, VGC 8.2. This detail requires the use of Versico's quick applied uncured EPDM flashing. The field fabricated pipe seal should be installed when the pre-molded pipe seals cannot be used, such as when a pipe is greater than 6 inches in diameter. This video will show you the use of two base flanges and one vertical wrap of QA uncured EPDM flashing. To determine the size of the base flange, measure 4 inches from the pipe seal in all directions, then measure the total distance between the marks. In this example, 13 inches. When using dusty membrane or membrane that has been exposed to dust or dirt, thoroughly clean the membrane and penetration with weathered membrane cleaner or EPDM primer. When using a pre-cleaned sheet, cleaning the membrane is not required unless the membrane becomes dirty. For this pipe, cut two pieces of QA uncured EPDM flashing approximately 9 inches by 13 inches off of a 9 inch roll. For both base flanges around the corners, fold flashing in half lengthwise and score the clear poly release liner. Apply EPDM primer to the deck membrane and the pipe at the proper coverage rate. Once the primer flashes off, perform the tack test. The primer should not transfer to a clean dry knuckle. Remove half the clear poly and place the flashing with the exposed tape onto the deck membrane at the marks that were made earlier. Cut halfway through the base flange until you are about one inch from the pipe. Press the flashing with the remaining poly into the angle change and cut the flashing around the pipe so that a minimum of one half inch of flashing will go up the pipe. Repeat this for the other side of the pipe. Remove the remaining poly one side at a time and set the flashing onto one of the four inch marks from earlier. Work the flashing from the outside into the angle change, ensuring that no bridging occurs. Press the flashing up onto the pipe, maintaining one half inch up onto the pipe. The base flanges should overlap a minimum of one inch. Roll the base flange with a two inch wide roller, paying particular attention to the step offs and angle changes. For the vertical pipe, measure the circumference of the pipe and add four inches to achieve three inches of splice. For this pipe, cut a piece of nine inch wide uncured EPDM flashing 18 inches long and round the corners. The vertical wrap must splice onto the deck a minimum of one inch. To make the installation easier, we will mark the pipe eight inches up from the angle change to ensure a one inch minimum overlap of the base flanges. Apply EPDM primer to the pipe at the proper coverage rate and allow primer to flash off. Once the primer flashes off, perform the tack test. The primer should not transfer to a clean dry knuckle. Remove the poly and fold the flashing in half. Set the flashing at the marks 8 inches up onto the pipe. Wrap the flashing halfway around the pipe and stop. Roll the flashing down into the angle change, making sure that bridging of the flashing does not occur. Prime the flashing where the vertical splice will occur. Roll the entire detail with a 2 inch wide roller. Pay particular attention to the step offs and angle changes.